Hey guys, as you might know the Raspberry Pi 5 was launched a few months ago and finally I got one myself. It's a pretty exciting piece of tech but to keep it safe and stylish I needed a good case. Thankfully Sunfounder has just released their brand new Raspberry Pi 5 case called the Pyron Man 5. Well it's not just a case, it enhances your Raspberry Pi 5 with improved cooling, M.2 NVMe support and much more. It's a DIY kit and contains a lot of part which we have to assemble just like a tiny miniature PC. Here are all the components including these small RGB cooling fans, a nice tower CPU cooler, an M.2 board and much more. We have also got detailed assembly guide to walk you through the process so let's dive in and get started. Alright guys, it was pretty fun to assemble this thing and look at this, it looks amazing. It really gives it a nice futuristic gaming PC type look. Talking about the case, its main body structure is built with metal along with the clear acrylic panels. On the front we have a tiny OLED display for the stats, a micro SD card slot and a power button. On the right side we can add an M.2 PCIe slot which is actually inside the case so obviously you have to remove this panel, install the SSD and put everything back. And we have still access to the GPIO pins. Turning around the back we have similar interface that a normal PC has like cooling fans and all the ports that Raspberry Pi offers. Now we have two full size HDMI instead of micro HDMI which is pretty good in my opinion. That's pretty much what we have, now let's power it up and see it in action. So I have paired it up with my portable gaming monitor and it perfectly complements the setup. So this is how it looks while working. The CPU cooler is pretty massive for the size of Raspberry Pi 5. It doesn't only look nice but it will also make it cool and chill when we overclock the board. It's nice to have this case if you wanna overclock your Raspberry Pi 5 and play around. Here on the OLED screen we can see the IP address, RAM and disk usage. You will need to install some additional settings into the OS to make all of these things work. And finally, the best part is M.2 NVMe support. Overall, I found this case really interesting and definitely recommend it. If you are looking for a Raspberry Pi 5 case, this would be a great option. That's it for this video guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one. Until then, bye bye.